Hey guys, Michael Stillwell here from Stillwell Pianos in Mesa, Arizona, and we have another Mason and Hamlin Double B. It's like Mason and Hamlin Double Week Month. We've had like four of them, and I think Nathan just bought like three more. So we love these pianos though, and Mason and Hamlin is my favorite brand, and these Double Bs are just massive pianos, and they just are so incredibly rich and full sounding. I love that they have full perimeter plates. Like I said, this is a 1990, so this is right when Mason and Hamlin was going back to Boston, going back to those old scale designs, and really going back to their roots. This is when they were bought out of um, Aeolian by the Burgett brothers. Um, and this is just a phenomenal, phenomenal piano. So when we got this piano in, the finish was not phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal. So we uh, refinished it. <laughs> and so we were able to do that because we're rebuilders. This thing looks perfect, guys. We did so much work to this thing. We did a uh, new lacquer on the finish itself, tuned it, regulated it, voiced it. Um, the previous owner had done some very bizarre regulating, so it was a really heavy piano. Um, but we brought it back to Mason and Hamlin's specs as far as down weight and up weight. And it turned out really, really nice. So I'm going to pull the action and show you what we got going on inside. All right. So now that we got the action out, I can show you what's going on inside. So first off, this thing is super, super, super clean. One really, really interesting fact about this. So some of you may know the name Falcone. And Falcone is a, uh, what we call a stencil brand now. Uh, most of them are ceramic made pianos and they stencil this name Falcone on the front of them. But Falcone was actually this super high end um, painting manufacturer that was connected to Mason and Hamlin at this time. And they ended up selling and there was a bunch of transition. I honestly don't know the story that well, but I know that they were definitely connected to Mason and Hamlin. Um, and this piano has Falcone action brackets. I'm not sure why but I do know that they were the same company at the same time, and so I'm sure that's what was going on here. Um, and it's just an awesome piano. I mean, I sold, we had a Falcone one time, like a real Falcone, like a United States made Falcone. Um, that was just like an incredible piano, and we only had it for maybe like two to three weeks because it sold that fast. But it was basically this piano, it was basically a double B. Um, so I wanted to pull the action to show you that. We don't normally do that. As you can see, this action is in really, really good shape. It's a very, very young piano. This came from a single owner. Um, the guy actually came in to ask us if we wanted to buy the piano, which is a little unique because normally they just send in an email. But he came in and he brought these pictures and he said, I bought this piano brand new in 1975. And uh, when we ran the numbers, we were pretty convinced that was impossible because this is a 1990. <laughs> so he must have just kind of forgot when he purchased the piano, but he bought it for his wife. Um, who can no longer play and it was kind of depressing her seeing it in the house so they sold it to us and we did all this work to it. So guys if you have any questions about this particular piano or any other piano on our website always feel free to shoot me an email at michael at stillwellpianos.com. Thanks for watching guys.